DLB Network, a place for gamers. Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, US underscore Army again, and I'm here with a big review. Two in one, buy, rent, or pass for both Guitar Hero World Tour and Little Big Planet. Remember, Guitar Hero World Tour, I tested on the PlayStation 3, but is actually going to be available on the PS3 as well as the 360 and the Wii. And Little Big Planet is a PS3 exclusive. Remember, before I start into this, I'm part of the DOB Network, so that's dob-network.com. See all of my reviews as well as the rest of us doing our uh, news and everything else we got. So, right into it, I'm going to start with Guitar Hero. Guitar Hero, I got the full bundle, drums, guitar, microphone, game, everything. The holes are bang, $189.99. Sounds like a lot of money, but you know what? If you're into these music games, if you like the big party games, you got a big group of people over, I think it's worth it. The instruments itself, I'm going to start with that. The guitar, much improved from the last time. It feels better. The whamming bar goes much better. The uh, they have the touch sensitive sliding on the fretboard there, and it's your standard Guitar Hero guitar. I like it better in Rock Band because it clicks. So the guitar is nice. The drum set, very, very, very nice. As long as you did not get one of the faulty ones that did go out there. I know that was in the news, but as for ones that are working, very nice. The cymbals. A great addition to it, it makes it feel so much more fluid and like realistic compared to the rock band uh, drums. Uh, they're not too loud, they're still somewhat loud, but they have a good bounce to them, they feel real realistic and you can actually get into it pretty good. So as for the drums, I like it, and the last, uh, man, the uh, foot pedal. I know rock band had a problem with them breaking, this one's very nice, it actually goes down and it hits the front center piece, so it's a, uh, the drum set's solid. As for the microphone, nothing special, standard microphone. Sounds good, plays good. But the game itself, it opened up a lot of new things that actually I really, really enjoy. I mean, yeah, it's got its standard songs, whether you love them or hate them, that's a mixed opinion on the, on the music, but it's there. They have downloadable content already, which is great. And of course, the new additions are gonna be like the, the studio, where you can create your own songs from scratch which actually works very, very well. I was very surprised. Uh, yeah, it's a bit frustrating at times, but if you take your time and work through it, it's a solid thing to use, and you can actually share some good content out there. And uh, the next new addition was basically to create your create, uh, your creator, create your uh, player, and uh, your, your rocker, I guess is that they say it. And it, it's a lot better than having to use the people from Guitar Hero 3 that looked really kind of freaky, but at least this time around you can modify them the way you like it. And you know what, the game's solid. It's a fun game. You, everyone come together, the instruments work well. And if you like the first Rock Band, then I would recommend getting the new Guitar Hero over the new Rock Band. Simply because the new Rock Band, unless you like the songs on that one better, there's not much uh, that's new, you know. So, I would say this is a must buy only if you are a hardcore Guitar Hero music playing or party game fan. But unless you don't want to ship out the $189, that's up to you. But I say it's worth it for those people who like these types of games. So it's a must buy in my books. Anyway, next one is one of the most hyped games of this year. Especially a big one for Sony and the PlayStation 3. It's easily going to be Little Big Planet. This game blew me away from the beginning. I mean, you're starting off, I started off just beating the story mode, going across, and you're saying, you know why, but the story mode, solid, it's, I mean, the story, there's not much of a story, should I say, but that's what it's called. But I mean, you need to do it if you want to create levels, because it unlocks all sorts of new stuff. But the cool thing about it is like, the levels just get better and better and better as you get farther along. And the cool thing is you look at it and you say, wow, I can make those levels with these tools. So this is a great addition to gaming. It's, yeah, it's solid, it's fun, it's good on that end. But then you get past that and you can create your own levels. So creating your levels works great. It can be a little frustrating and overwhelming at times. But once you get the hang of it, it's a solid, solid thing to use and you can spend hours making a level. 
Um, the only thing that gets a little frustrating is the rewind button because sometimes you accidentally do it and you'll jump way back and you forget to do this and then when you save it and play it, you lost whatever you just made. So that's a little a little sketchy in my books, but it's, it's there and it works great. And the best thing about this game is the community. Playing other people's levels just blew me away. You can play some absolute shit ones, but you know what, you can play some of the best looking levels you've ever seen. We posted a video on there made by a Japanese guy doing the, uh, I think it was the Galaga, or it's a shooting one with the spaceship, I forget what it's called, but some of these levels that these people are making with these tools is almost ridiculous that they can even achieve this. But the community's great, you can do that, heart levels, play your favorite levels, people can play your levels, let you know how it's doing. You can jump on there and play levels with your friends, up to three more friends. You know what? I mean, this game, it, it's worth the hype. I believe it. my review is going to be up there with the other ones, because I seriously believe that this game is a must-buy for any age, any gender, any anything. This game's fun. I'm playing it. My father's playing it. My younger brother's playing it. My mom's getting a kick out of watching it. I'm sure she's going to play it. It's fun for the full, whole family. So. This is a must buy, must buy, must buy. If not, if you don't already got a PS3, this is a must buy to get your PS3 for, as well as all these other games that are coming out. Resistance 2, review on that coming very soon, as well as Killzone and Motorstorm. What else you got out there? I mean, PlayStation's got it this holidays, but don't leave the 360 in the dust. It's got Gears 2, which is going to be a solid game. I'll also have a review on that one. So basically, that's going to be it. Must buy for both these. I know, we're going to be broke this holiday season. I'm feeling your pain, believe me. But anyway, this is me, US underscore Army. You check me out at uh, youtube.com forward slash US Army Reviews. But ba best place to check my view, uh, reviews out is just on the DOB network, dob-network.com. You'll see my reviews on the main page. Otherwise, you'll see it under the Reviews tab. But you'll see all the news, podcasts, everything else. Check it out. It's a great thing. We're getting bigger. You know what, guys? If you need to, email me, us underscore army at dob-network.com. Let me know what you guys think. I'm liking a lot of the support from you guys. It's been getting better by the day. I'm improving my videos, I hope. And I'm just trying to do this for you. Let's help expand the DLB network and make it even better. So I'll try and get y'all. I'll send you guys a link to a DLB network banner that you guys can put on your MySpace or Facebook or your signatures on forums. If you just email me, I'll send you that link if you want. So be prepared for the, all this. These reviews coming out. I got myself uh, the contest, the little big contest. Yeah, send me an email if you're going to be doing that one. Check that video out as well. And also, Killzone 2, I'm going to end it on this one, is going to be easily game of the year in 2009 unless something out else is coming out that we don't know of. But Killzone 2, Simply amazing. Thanks, guys.